my channel. My name is Jenny and I live in Victoria, Australia and I've just received an order from Timu uh, which I'd like to share with you. It's a random bunch of stuff that um, you know could be really good for Christmas presents, birthday presents, um, some helpful items for around the house. Uh, so let's get started. First up I did buy a Stanley dupe. Um, it's huge. It's really, really nice. It's got an open um, screw top opening. Most of you who've seen Timu before have um, already seen these, so I won't elaborate too much on this. But yep, it's a it's a beauty. It's really lovely. Now, I also got one for the husband. I do a little bit of lawn bowls um, here in. Victoria and it gets very hot like it's not a humid heat it's um, like in northern Australia it's more of a dry heat so you know we get very hot playing bowls out in the open so I did buy myself one of these uh, neck, neck fans and they go around and um, they've got the the air comes out how do I turn this on? There we go. There's a little button. And I'm not sure whether you can hear here, but it's got a um, few settings. Little little micro charger. Yep, that'll come in very handy. I also got a, a little microfiber um, cooling cloth. So you dip it in water and, and it's quite long. You can put it around your neck or tie it around your wrist. And it's good around the wrist because that's where you can cool your blood with all the veins. So if you've got a nice cool on your wrist, that's really good if you if you're overheating on a hot day. Um, this this was a free gift at the end of my order, in the first order they um, Timu offered me a free gift, so I picked this out. Um, and in in my order I already had a black black one, and what they are is. Um, mobile phone covers, pouches, they're waterproof um, and they, oh, how, how to open this, save my fingernails, anyway they, they'll be handy when we go on holidays and we're at the beach or um, somewhere around water where you know we may drop our phones in some water, these would be great. Um, we can tie it around our neck if we'd like. It's got a little, um, a little strap that goes on the top, just like that. And so that'd be great. So I've got two of those. Also, when I'm travelling, I do put my shoes sometimes in with all the rest of my clothes, which isn't a really good idea. So I bought some shoe bags. There's a pack of five that I can, you know, I don't have to use every one for travelling. I can use them at home as well. So they'll be very handy. They're the smaller size for probably ladies' shoes or um thongs and also when i'm traveling i don't do a lot of traveling i um traveled around australia for a little little while a few years ago and saw a bit of our own country um uh, but we we do go to bali once or twice a year and we've met a lot of people over there and uh, very friendly and so this is a um a little bottle bag that you can hang around your shoulders shoulder and carry a bottle of water when we're walking around a lot 
and it's got a little pocket as well to you know you can put your phone in there or something else whatever you like it's that'll be good it's made out of a nylon mesh so very waterproof and really nice so I like that one and also on the traveling traveling side um, I got some little pouches to put in the suitcase just to keep everything separate like your underwear and you know your um, bits and pieces so that you know exactly where things are and it keeps them still in the suitcase uh, so this is a six piece uh, uh, travel pack it's got three three different size um, with a mesh top that opens up like so on, that one closed it open already and this is the smaller one and that can you can put smaller you know bits and pieces in that like your shampoos and what have you in there so there's three of that design and three plain pouches of three different sizes so so that's lovely just to have and i got pink because i've got a pink suitcase so and they weren't very expensive but they will come in very handy and another another little traveling item this this is a little belt um, that clips on around your waist my husband um, has always used one of these but they're getting a bit worn out so i got him a new one and it's to put your know, money in here he puts um aussie dollars in one and bali indonesian rupee are in the other one so he doesn't get them all muddled up so yep that's another good little thing that i found uh, i did get a um a first aid pouch uh, put to put a few little things in in the car or even when I'm traveling uh, so I just you know band-aids and band-aids and creams and things can go in this and that's just a tiny little little size but you know you you know whatever you need for a quick getaway that can go in there Most of this stuff's just random. Um, when when you're buying from Timu, you, you get on the website, uh, their site, and you're just scrolling, scrolling, and you know a lot of things. You know you probably don't really need them, but you know you see things that might be nice for Christmas presents and gives you ideas of oh you know that might be nice. But um, so anyway, I've um, I've got six grandchildren and nine other children that call me nanny so i've got to sort of keep my eye out for different little bits and pieces for them so this is a um travel travel luggage tag and i've got one little girl that that's into flamingos at the moment and so i thought this one might be nice and she could put it on her school bag um so that's just a little flamingo sorry about the sticker on the front but you know, i won't open it because it is a gift and same with this one this is a, a sloth a little boy lot is into sloths at the moment so you know everything seems to be sloth everywhere so he's another one that can he can hang on his school bag um i've got a little six-year-old granddaughter that's um i've got a birthday coming up soon and um she likes diamond painting but they get a, the, the big diamond painting art work is 
you know, gets it, they get a little bit over it. Um, so this one's, oh, where am I open? This is a gift as well, so I don't really want to tear into it. Um, it's got 18 little diamond sticker art. So it comes with all the, all the beads you need, all everything you need, and it's got like the little the little pictures. And so you can do one of them every now and again, and won't get bored of it. Hopefully, and keep her amused for a little while. Uh, that's lovely, I thought. And same, the same little girl. Um, oh, she's got 101 scrunchies and hair ties and and clips and everything. And so I thought, well, something a little bit different. She could <laughs> she could have a um, some hair just to tie in her hair. You know, sometimes at school they have crazy hair day. And just so this might be nice to give her as a little gift. They're quite cute. And what else have we got here? Oh, I've got, let's put those aside. Now this little gadget here is really needed because I've got two little French bulldogs that are in desperate need of a bath and, you know, you soap them up and, you know, you've got them in the trough and just trying to wash them and the, the flannel or whatever, you know, you're trying to wash them and they just don't come clean. So anyway, this is a little scrubber for a dog and it's very soft and what you do is you just take the lid off the lid off put your dog shampoo in and put the lid back on again and they just just sits on there and away you go scrub your dog and there you go so that's going to be used quite regular i think I'm waiting for the weather to get a little bit warmer so that I can give them a you know a good bath. Um, because I am into Frenchies, I've got a little stubby holder that my husband keeps taking all my st stubby holders and takes them outside and and they get a bit dirty. So this is my little little can holder. Frenchies is in a bright. Quite cute. And, and while we're on Frenchies, I've got a little sign. Not sure where I'm going to put that one, but that might cover up a PowerPoint that I don't use that's in the middle of the wall. I might put that over that one. Okay. While we're on to decorations, I've got one Christmas decal that goes on the window. Uh, this is quite nice, so I think I'll be ordering a few more to go with that. So we've got a lot of windows here at the front that I usually decorate for Christmas, so I'll, I'll just get some more that the bit like that. Now we're on to some handy gadgets. There's, a set of, there's four little USB lights. This is the cool light. They do have them in warm light as well. So this is the cool white light ones. So these would be handy, I thought, if we are, say, in a car and we just need a, a little bit of light or, or travelling or, or the kids want to... Um, night light in the bedroom. I can put one of these in the PowerPoint. Oh, those handy little things. And another little handy gadget is a 
pop-up funnel. Don't have to explain about a funnel, but they, they'll be good for filling up a sauce bottle or oil or anything liquidy. That's one. Um, oh, I found another. <laughs> and I found another French Bulldog. Another picture. How cute's that? I'm going to put that in a frame and hang it on the back of the toilet door. Because <laughs> he's he's on he's on a toilet. If you can see that. He's on a toilet reading the newspaper. <laughs> That's quite quite gorgeous. Um another little gift for a boy is a it's got a special name this hammer but I'm not really into the um, Avengers or whatever they are so this is a Thor hammer key ring and it's very heavy very solid heavy metal so I quite like it myself actually <laughs> it's a little pack of needle threaders and I got these because I can't thread a needle these days because being the age that I am the eyesight's not too good so what you do with these is you put the little it's got they got a little point um, a little a little point there with a hook on it you put that into the needle and wrap your cotton around and then pull it through and this would be good on the sewing machine as well because I can never never thread the sewing machine needle either because the little threader is the built-in threader on the sewing machine has um, somehow stopped working so yeah you get five in a pack all different colors so hopefully I won't lose any of them and I'll use them next time I want to sew something. Um, I've got scissors that are good for on my keychain. Very handy. And I won't be able to have them on the aeroplane on my keychain. But um, other than that, they'll be very handy. I've got um, about 200 of these because I ordered two lots. Don't know why. These are promoted as shower caps or food covers. So I don't really need a lot of shower caps all the time. So I've got about 200. So I've you know, I'll just use them as food covers when I'm taking food away, um, when I'm invited out to a barbecue or something. And I also have um, self-adhesive medical tape, which is really handy to have in the cupboard. Um, I've got the dogs might hurt themselves, or I've got miniature horses that sometimes hurt themselves. So, um, you know, this is these are really good to have, and it was a a lot cheaper than what you buy in um, the chemist pharmacy or at a pet shop so I grab one of those now I've got oh, I'll get a bowl of water here so a bowl of water and I've got these little soaps so I'm just going to test it out. I'll just, just open it up. And there's five little different colours and fragrances. And what they are a 
tiny little piece of soap. So I'll just wet my hands and rub enough soap to wash your hands or the kids' hands when they're out and about. So there's a lot of soap in that one tiny little flower. And they weren't very much money at all, just these little. Okay, so that comes to the end of my video. Thank you all for joining me. Um, I will be doing more videos in the future. I've got um, more orders coming. Um, and what I propose on doing is in future orders, I will be buying... Um, a little toy or a gift or something uh, to give to people um, in Bali. I've got a, a box here and I really haven't got anything much yet but I'll start off with this little rabbit that I had here and I'm going to put that in the box and it's going to be the charity box for kids in Bali. So please like and subscribe to my channel and each order, I'll be putting in a little gift and I think I'll be going in May to Bali and I'll give the, the toys and the gifts away to little kids that really don't have much. Um, so yes, thank you for joining me and I'll see you next time.